¿Listo? Listo. Hey, now, I didn't kill anybody. Man, I'm a killer salesman, but I'm not a killer. Last time you were supposed to help out, you flicked. I almost got pinched. A buddy of mine's doing five years. We can forgive them, but we cannot forgive ourselves for not showing them the way. They go with the flow. We have a different flow to offer. That sunk millions into his research and suddenly wants to give it all away. There's one thing internet porn has taught me. You don't get rich by giving it away. Cops have tried coming at us before. Nothing ever sticks. What the fuck was that? We need to talk. I can assure you, BSI's products have the most stringent safety standards in the industry. I'm gonna need you to help me find out who this belongs to. I need to know by tomorrow. I just found out the feds have an informant in the diner. So what do you want to do? Good. How can you not trust someone willing to do something this nuts? You want me to go undercover? Are you crazy? This is a very dangerous game you're playing, Davies. That's what it boils down to, doesn't it? Who's got the better story? You can't be serious. You still think I did it? Here comes the dust. I gotta say, that was really some pulse quickening action right there. Uh, Blaine, what's it been like playing a role like Special Agent Andy Lister? Awesome. That seems right. The more that I think about it, for me. Whoa! Oh, I do my own stunts, but you are awesome. You lost your touch, Ari. Oh yeah, how's that? Ertz doesn't want Vince. You were set up. He was just trying to force me to close Emil Hirsch. He had two million less than I wanted. Explain to your client that you dragged him back here for nothing. I'm gonna skull fuck you, Davies! You just did, Ari. Mr. Afron, you're on with Mr. Gold and Mr. Davies. Zach, buddy, what's up? You're fired. I'm with Ari now. Good young Tiff. You know, those comedy clubs in Mars? You can hear the laughs on Jupiter. <laughs> I love how you talk. I have no idea what you're saying, but I enjoy your melody. You're a nice guy. Does that surprise you? You got here fast. You didn't break any laws on the way here. Though I do know someone. I'm adopted. No, it's, I mean, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. You ever feel like things didn't turn out the way you anticipated? No. I always knew I'd be incredibly wealthy and successful. I'm Greta Kane, Nabel Steinsky. Kane Nabel Steinsky. Wow, that's, uh, mm -hmm. where, where's that from? Ellis Island. You had your day, Michael. You're making a fool of yourself in that courtroom, isn't that obvious? Dupree got to you, didn't she? That's what they do, Jeff. No loyalty. People like Dupree go to Kel Air and make deals, and people like you accept them. For 10 years, I watched you get rich off of companies like Belcor, destroying anyone who got in your way. And now, all of a sudden, you have a change of heart? You think defending that kid makes you some kind of savior? You should have settled. Happy Thanksgiving. He told me he'd kill himself if I ever tried to confess I knew he was serious, and I know he still is. He'll die if I turn myself in, he's gonna die if I don't. I don't know what to do. I killed that man, Olivia. I did it. I was angry. What he did to my sister, I... But I'm the one who needs to pay for what I did, not my father. For 15 years, I have tried to take responsibility for this, but he will not let me. I don't know what to do. I cheated on you. Twice. Once when you went home for the fourth, and once when I was in Europe. Either way, we're done. Done? <laughs> Not quite, pal.
I know you're excited about this movie, and it's a, it's a good little part, but here's the thing. I got you an audition for a guest-starring role in a pilot. Yeah, what's it called? CSI Minneapolis.